hi guys welcome back to my channel this is your girl all things shannon welcome my old subscribers my new subscribers today i'm here to share with you how i make my salmon croquettes with homemade romalade sauce all right these are the ingredients you will need olive oil mayonnaise dijon mustard tony saturated creole seasoning cayenne pepper garlic powder onion powder italian breadcrumbs obey crystal hot sauce, flour, one egg, white onion, celery, red bell peppers, and garlic, and of course the fresh salmon. All right guys, let's get started. All right guys, what I did was I baked my salmon in the oven at 350 degrees for five minutes. I'm adding my seasoning blend, onion, celery, red bell peppers, and garlic. I'm adding the Tony Saturated Creole seasoning. You guys know I don't measure. You add the spices according to your taste. Now I'm adding garlic powder. onion powder now I'm adding Old Bay Old Bay is going to bring out that seafood taste cayenne pepper now I'm adding crystal hot sauce you can add any hot sauce of your choice. Dijon mustard. And a little bit of mayonnaise. Now you want to mix all that in together. Now I'm adding the egg and the breadcrumbs. This is going to bind the salmon cakes so they won't break up while frying them. I added a little bit of flour. This will also help bind the salmon cakes. As you can see, I started frying the salmon cakes and I also added some olive oil to my hot pan. Let these fry for two minutes on each side. Okay guys, this is how your salmon cake should look nice golden brown. Alright, these are all the salmon cakes. They are all done. 
I'm going to put these off to the side and let them cool and now it's time to start on the romalade sauce. In a bowl, I added a half a cup of mayonnaise. Now I'm adding two tablespoons of horse radish. Now I'm adding a tablespoon of Dijon mustard. Two teaspoons of ketchup. I'm adding one cap full of lemon juice. Now mix it all together. If you need to add more, you can add more. I'm adding just a little bit more of ketchup just to add some color to it. Now what I like to do to my romalade sauce, I like to add just a little bit more kick to it. So I'm adding some of the Tony Saturates Creole seasoning. Garlic powder. Cayenne pepper. And what I like to add just to give it just a little bit more flavor is Worcestershire sauce. Okay, this is all done. Now you want to put this in the refrigerator until it's time to serve. Okay guys, this is how my salmon croquettes turned out with my homemade romalade sauce and I sliced up some lemons. Thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed this video on today. Don't forget to subscribe, like, share, and leave a comment. And don't forget to hit that bell notification. It will let you know each time I post a video. Until next time, bye guys.